Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with more Here Comes the Pain as Chris Benoit has a bit of a message for us. Hey, Kurt, have you got a minute? My uh, tag team partner, of course, is Chris Benoit. Let's not forget that. Hey, I think I was a little pushy the other day. Sorry about that. <laughs> when he was upset not driving and things like that. Nobody likes bickering over that kind of stuff. I hope we can forget about it. Well, I hope so too. Kurt hasn't really got much to say. So everything's cool now, right? Cool. You know what? Chris Benoit is a weird guy. I'm not real keen on what's ooh, this direction he's taken us. Anyways, let's go check out what else is going on backstage. And we got The Undertaker. You feel like you're on top of the world. I look in your eyes and see it. Oh boy, I don't like where this is going. It's that look that says nobody can touch me. You know how many times... Uh-oh. Undertaker is pissed off at us. You know how many times I've seen that look? Probably a few. You've done it all, right? Well, let me tell you something. Alright, well, what are you going to say to us? You haven't been tested yet. Well, yeah, we had a few tests against Eddie Guerrero. We know we've been okay. Yeah, we've... It hasn't been that easy, I, I guess. I don't know. Have you ever had to wipe the blood off your eyes? Uh, your eyebrow? Have you ever had to felt down and felt ribs sticking out where they were broken? And wonder when your next breath was going to come? All right, this is getting weird. All right, Undertaker, where are you taking this? And then figure out how you were going to win the match. Look, Undertaker, we can do it all. We're not afraid. We're not afraid of the dead man. Well, there hasn't been anyone who's given us a real beating yet. Okay, well, are you going to do it right now? I think he, I think they, I think he is. Uh, that's going to change real soon because I'm going to take you someplace that you ain't ever been. I'm going to beat you and I'm going to bust you up. And if you survive that, then I might have something. To, then you might have something to brag about. Okay. Life makes no exceptions. Oh, I think Undertaker is going to beat the hell out of us right now. So this is not good. To me, it's all about the fight. And you ain't had those fights yet. Your ass is mine, boy. Oh, boy. Well, should we fight him or should we leave him alone? You know what? Let's fight him. Nobody talks to Kurt Angle, the Olympic gold medals like that. We are going to fight The Undertaker. Let's get it on backstage, shall we? Angle and The Undertaker, a backstage fight. As Angle with a few suplexes to start things off here. This is what we want to see from Kurt Angle. We're willing to get in there and let's fight and let's see how we go. We're not going to back down. You know, Undertaker's bigger, he's better, he maybe even better than us, but, you know, we're going to fight. You know, he says that we can't step up, he says that we can't, you know, we haven't earned our, our way yet. Nobody's really tested us. Well, Undertaker, here's your test, and it's Kurt Angle. He's slamming uh, the old TV on your head. She's back in the day where the TVs weighed a ton. You know, nowadays the TVs are just, you know, flat screen, but, you know, you had the big box TVs. And when you got, if you get hit over the head with one of those TVs, that would hurt. I guarantee you that. Uh, those are the days of the big TVs such like that. It's uh, it's pretty crazy now that, um, you know, if you get hit in the head with a TV these days, it probably wouldn't hurt that much. Anyways, Angle might look to use the TV again. And he went for it. Missed out, though. Is Undertaker trying to use it? And he gets him. Uh-oh. Right across the head. Now Undertaker, he's got that uh, boxing bag in his way. He's got a hold of Kurt Angle though. Angle's trying to fight him off as Angle into the wall. And whoever designed that wall and built that one probably needs to get fired because that wall went down pretty quickly. I think if you knocked on that wall, it would probably uh, destroy itself. So anyways, we've unlocked a brand new room. We've got the showers now and someone's got some photos of the divas. So someone's obviously a bit creepy. As uh, Kurt Angle, rear naked choke, trying to make The Undertaker tap out. Apparently there's pinfalls and submissions in a backstage fight. That's good to see. Two guys who, you know, just look at a fight and just beat the hell out of each other. Apparently a referee needs to get himself involved. That's fine. Undertaker now has Angle by the throat. Oh boy. Here comes a choke slam. Undertaker may be able to pin Kurt Angle here. Kurt Angle's in trouble. He's trying to fend him off though. Angle... Thought about the, the Angle Slam. He's not going to get it instead. He's in the toilet. Oh, no. Angle flushing the toilet. He's, all, he's done his business. He's back out. 
Angle with some rights and lefts now, trying to keep the Undertaker down. Angle may go for the ankle lock as well. We'll have to see which direction he's going to take. Can he even get a big move on? He needs to find something big. Looking for the ankle slam again. Undertaker able to get the elbow. And uh-oh, Undertaker now going for the last ride. And Kurt Angle. Good night. The last ride. Angle could be done here. Here is the cover. The counter two. And there's the three. Well, I bet Kurt Angle wishes he never came into the locker room with The Undertaker tonight. Well, that's a tough going. Well, there you go. So, what else have we got in store for us in this one? We know we need, we need to team up with Chris Benoit. Who are our opponents? It's Eddie and Ray. We just can't get away from these two guys. Eddie Guerrero, week after week after week, we have to take him on. How many times do we have to beat him before he gets the message that he's not good enough? Well, he's brought Ray Mysterio along with him too, so... Eddie and Ray versus Angle and Benoit. What a match this should be. Four of the best going around. So, Kurt Angle, the US champion. He just got his ass kicked by The Undertaker. Can he bounce back in this tag team match? Let's hope for his sake that he can because, uh, he, you know, he took a bit of a bad whooping, let's be fair. Well, here's Eddie Guerrero. We've beaten him up a few times. And we're going to go one more time against him. We're going to beat him up again. This time we've got Chris Benoit in our corner. And I tell you what, Chris Benoit, you know, he's a crazy guy. He's a bit of a weird dude. First, he wants us to read his biography. Then he's, you know, wants us to drive. Then he doesn't want us to drive. And I don't know what's going on in his mind. And now he's apologizing for being weird. So let's hope this is the end of Chris Benoit's weird acts because it's starting to worry me. I'm not going to lie. Here's Kurt Angle. He's getting ready for this tag match. The US champ will start this match up off against Eddie Guerrero. Here we go. Underway right now. Guerrero and Angle. Angle almost put in a pinning predicament earlier on there by Eddie. Hits a German suplex as well to follow it up. So far, so good here for Guerrero. Going to drive Angle in the corner. This is not good here for Kurt Angle in this corner. Gets met with a drop kick there by Guerrero. He shrugs off Guerrero there. Now Angle, a few more shots there behind. Chris Benoit's going to get in the ring as well, having a bit of a closer look. Going to try and help out. Instead, it's going to be shoulders down here for Angle, but the rope break again. Guerrero getting his timing and his placement all wrong right now because he had Benoit right there to break his things up anyway, so I'm not sure what Guerrero was trying to do. Perhaps that's why he's not the US champ anymore because he keeps messing up. Shoulders down here, and this could be it. Oh, geez, that's a near fall. Anyway, as we move along in this match, the referee's down, and Benoit's trying to pin the referee. Not every day you see that one. Maybe he is um, going a bit crazy. Double drop kick. Down goes Ray and Guerrero. Angle's going to be in this one now. So Angle's back. Benoit's going to get back on the apron as Kurt Angle trying to fend off Eddie Guerrero. That was a lot. That was really fancy for just uh, you know a leg sweep in the end. Guerrero now trying to make... Angle tap out here. He's got the legs locked up, and now Angle's in the middle of the ring. Nowhere to go. Will this be enough for Guerrero to win here? Guerrero trying his best. But uh, Eddie Guerrero can't win it. Now, go for the cover. This could be here for Angle, but a kick out of one. One more tag team action here is uh, Guerrero still in there with Angle. Rey Mysterio trying to get himself involved. Not going to happen. But... Uh, a win here tonight for Angle and Benoit would be huge. That's with themselves in title contention. Atomic drop there. We'll see how far this tag team goes. I don't know. I mean, it's... I don't know if we could trust Chris Benoit. He's a bit out there. He's a bit crazy. So it's it's hard to really trust him. I'm not sure how far this tag team's really going to go. You never know. But now Guerrero going to try and make Angle tap out again. Eddie Guerrero trying to win this thing. He's been trying it and trying it and trying it. Not much luck though for Guerrero. Is this now? Is this going to be in here for Angle? He's in the middle of the ring, which is a bonus, but uh, he's getting close, very close, in fact, but not quite there. As Angle survives, Guerrero going to try his luck here with another cover. Is this going to get closer? He does with a two count, but uh, Angle trying to fend him off. Angle in trouble though. Face into the mat right there. He's going to shrug off. Guerrero now from behind. Look out. Angle slam. Maybe even caught some of the table on the way down. And now into the ankle lock. 
Guerrero has got nowhere to go. He's in the middle of the ring. But he hasn't taken too much damage to the legs. He could be okay here. Kurt Angle can't quite get Guerrero to tap, can he? No. He's going to go for the cover instead after the angle slam. Now the angle lock. Is this going to be it? Yes, it will be. Angle and Benoit win. So there you have it. The tag team of Benoit and Angle works once again. It's Kurt Angle with the victory. It's Kurt Angle pinning Eddie Guerrero once again. So we'll have to see how long can this team work out for. So far, so good. Backstage, though, a few little issues arising. Can they hang on, though? Well, well, here we go again. Chris Benoit is angry. What the world were you thinking out there? Don't you don't you even want to be here? Well, of course we do. That was the worst match I've ever been a part of. Don't give me that look. <laughs> He's giving that stun look. What the hell are you talking about? I've just had about I've just about had enough of you. I mean, what is what is wrong with Benoit? Now here comes Eddie Guerrero to try and stop things. Same with Rey Mysterio. Well, Eddie, uh, Chris Benoit's friends. You stay out of it. Everything about this arrangement sucks. Well, I couldn't agree more. I've always had to do the paper paperwork for the rent a car. All right, well, that's not a big deal. And the other day you ate you ate all my pizza. Well, just buy another one. I can't do this anymore. I quit. I can't see how, how anyone will want to work with you. I mean, he ate his pizza. I think he's overreacting a little bit. We just won a match. We could win the tag titles, and he's not happy because I ate a slice of his pizza. Well, I think he's got his priorities a little bit wrong there. Well, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this episode of Here Comes the Pain. Uh, it looks as though this tag team between Benoit and Kurt Angle is over. What's our future? I'm not sure. But hang on, we've got a message here from Taz. Well, Taz, what's he want? Next month there will be an event in London. And I was told to ask if you're interested in participating. Should we go to London? Hmm. Well, I can't see why not. I mean, we might get an opportunity. Or maybe, maybe we won't. Who knows? I don't know what the consequences will be if we don't go. So, let's go to London. We're going on the UK trip. Well, there you have it. We're going to London. Well, ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this episode of Here Comes the Pain, leave a like. Next episode should be interesting. We might be taking a bit of a different turn in the series and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you also subscribe to see more episodes coming your way soon. Check me out on Twitter at Brendan Plays. And thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.